let us open our Bible to the book of Psalm 85. Psalm 85. Res restoration of the church. Restoration of church. Psalm 85 verses 1 to 7. Prayers for the continuance of former mercies. The sense of present afflictions should not wipe away the remembrance of former mercies. The favor of Yahweh is the fountain of happiness to nations as well as to particular persons. When Yahweh forgives sin, he covers it. And when he covers the sin of his people, he covers it all. See what the pardon of sin is. In compassion, in compassion to us, when Christ, our intercessor, has stood before Yahweh, he has turned away his anger. When we are reconciled to Yahweh, then and not Till then, we may expect the comfort of his being reconciled with us. He shows mercy to those who, to those to whom he grants salvation, for salvation is of mere mercy. Yahweh's people may expect sharp and tedious afflictions when they commit sin, but when they return to him with humble prayer, he will make them again to rejoice in him. Psalm 85 verses 8 to 13, trust in Yahweh's goodness. Yahweh's mercy is unfailing and his salvation is always available. He offers guidance that results in peace for those who listen and obey. But the pursuit of folly prevents people from benefiting from God's wisdom. The psalmist emphasizes Yahweh's gifts by describing them in pairs. In pairs. Mercy and truth righteousness and peace, truth and faithfulness. Even more than pairs, they appear to be married together. Despite the current troubles of his nation, the psalmist maintains confidence that Yahweh will still provide good things for his people. Yahweh's righteousness will prevail. So, sooner or later, Yahweh will speak peace to his people if he does not command outward peace, yet he will suggest inward peace, speaking to the hearts of the anointed by his spirit, as it is said in Hebrews. 3 verse 7 and 1 Corinthians 6 verse 19. Peace is spoken and given only to those who turn from sin. All sin is folly, especially backsliding, for it is the greatest folly to return to sin. Surely, Yahweh's salvation is near whatever our difficulties and distresses whatever they are also his honor is secure that glory may dwell in our land and the truth of the promises is shown by the divine mercy in sending the Redeemer the divine justice is now satisfied by the great atonement. Christ, the way, truth, and life 
sprang out of the earth when he took our nature upon him and divine justice looked upon him with, with we looked upon him well pleased and satisfied for he sick all good things especially the Holy Spirit are given to those who ask him through Christ the pardon sinner becomes fruitful in good works and by looking to and trusting in the Savior's righteousness finds his or her feet set in the way of Yahshua's steps. Righteousness is a sure guide both in meeting Yahweh and in following him. Know this and the Lord Yahweh will bless you. Amen. Hallelujah. You, Lord Yahweh, showed favor to your land in the name of Yeshua. Let us take these prayer points which are started. Lord, you restored the fortunes of Jacob in the name of Yeshua. Yahweh Shaddai. You forgave the iniquity of your people and covered all their sins in the name of Yeshua. Father Yahweh, you set aside all your wrath and turn from your fierce anger in the name of Yeshua. Restore us again, Yahweh our Savior, and put away your displeasure toward us in the name of Yeshua the Messiah, we pray. Will you be angry? Will you be angry? Will you be angry with us forever? Yahweh Olam, will you prolong your anger to all generations? In the name of Yeshua the Messiah, we pray. Will you not receive us again that our people may, may rejoice in you in the name of Yeshua the Messiah we pray. Show us your unfailing love, Lord Yahweh, and grant us your salvation in the name of Yeshua the Messiah we pray. I will listen to what Yahweh says in the name of Yeshua he promises peace to his people, his faithful servants, but he lets them not turn to folly in the name of Yeshua. Surely Yahweh's salvation is near those who fear him, that his glory may dwell in our land in the name of Yeshua love and faithfulness meet together in the name of Yeshua. Righteousness and peace kiss each other in the name of Yeshua. Fruitfulness springs forth from the earth and righteousness looks down from heaven in the name of Yeshua. Faithfulness springs forth from the earth and righteousness looks down from heaven in the name of Yeshua. Yahweh will indeed give what is good and our land will yield its harvest in the name of Yeshua the Messiah we pray. Righteousness goes before Lord Yahweh and prepares the way for his steps. Thank you, Lord, all to your glory, in the mighty name of Yeshua, the Messiah, we pray. Thank you, Father Yahweh, for your word of wisdom, your word of guidance, your word of teaching, your word of enlightening, your word of spiritual strengthening, spiritual growth, spiritual elevation. Thank you, Father Yahweh, that you heard our confessions, you heard our prayers of repentance, and after you heard, you took away 
our dirty garment of sin and iniquity and you dress as with a brand new garment, a garment cleaner than snow, heaven the garment of your own spirit. Thank you, Father Yahweh, that you heard our cries, our supplication, our requests, our prayers. Thank you, Lord, for your mercy, for your grace. Thank you, Father, for your forgiveness. Thank you, Lord, for your, for your, for your, that you heard our prayers. Lord Almighty, we give you glory, we give you honor, we give you all the praise. In the mighty name of Yeshua, for the Messiah, we pray. This is the prayer line of our Assembly of Christ followers. We hold two prayer sessions on this prayer line every day, from Monday to Saturday. Our Monday session starts at 12 a.m. and our session starts at 9.30 p.m. During the week, we hold church services on Wednesday from 7 to 9 p.m. We normally hold the Word of study. On Thursday, we are open to take your for spiritual counseling. To get your appointment, call the phone number 240-440-1438. On Sunday, our Sunday service starts at 9.30 a.m. And every first Friday of the month, we hold an ad vigil. The ad vigil starts at 10.30 p.m. Let us pray these closing prayers. Let us pray the prayer, good Lord, yes, for the Messiah left us to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And leave us not into temptation, but deliver us of evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. We seal all our prayers with the blood of Yeshua. We seal all our prayers with the blood of Yeshua. We seal all our prayers with the blood of Yeshua. We seal all our prayers with the blood of Yeshua. We seal all our prayers with the blood of Yeshua. We seal all our prayers with the blood of Yeshua. We seal all our prayers with the blood of Yeshua. Thank you, Lord. All to your glory. In the mighty name of Yeshua, the Messiah, we pray. Lord, thank you for your answers to our prayers. Lord, thank you for your answers to our prayers. Father, Yahweh, yeah, thank you for your answers to our prayers. Lord, thank you for your answers to our prayers. Father, thank you for your answers to our prayers. Lord, thank you for your answers to our prayers. Lord, thank you for your answers to our prayers. Thank you, Lord, all to your glory. In the mighty name of Yeshua, the Messiah, we pray. Now with the waving of our hands to our loving Father Yahweh, let us shout seven joyful hallelujah, seven victorious hallelujah, and, and seven thanksgiving hallelujah to our good Father Yahweh. Hallelujah. 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 May Father Yahweh bless each and every one of this prayer land and this worship place. May Father Yahweh bless us as we go out. May He bless us as we come in. May Father Yahweh make it permanent His answers to our prayers. May Father Yahweh lay His right hand upon us. May He dress us in His cloud of glory and surrender us with His edge of fire. May Father Yahweh settle us on our, our promised land, the land that flows with milk and spirit, with milk and honey, the most beautiful of lands. May He settle us with good health, happiness, prosperity, success, and eternal life. Go in peace. May the peace of our Lord Yahshua, the Messiah, be with us all. Amen. Hallelujah.